Well, the night before uh, the eve of uh, the picture of the editor rang me from Belfast and says, "Paul, look, I hope you're, uh, I hope you're really nervous. This is important. This is a global uh, picture that you're going to be taking." And I said, "Look, I'm halfway down a bottle of wine. I don't know what city we are." And he was in a real panic. He says, "You need to be on your game for this." I says, "Look, it's a handshake." I says, "I've done hundreds, thousands of handshakes over my career." I says, "Look, I'll, I'll, I'll come together all right." More people were nervous about this than I was. Uh, the Queen came round the corner, looked, met the first guy, uh, Peter Robinson and straight to Martin McGuinness, um, the handshake. And it's the longest handshake I think I've actually shot. I actually timed it, and I think it was around about four seconds. And four seconds for a handshake is quite long. Uh, so we had plenty of frames of that there, and it was perfect. Uh, really, really nice, and the Queen met the other couple of people and left, and that was it. And I drove over to Stormont Hotel, uh, where I uh, walked in there, and everybody was in the restaurant, and this, my picture was there. The Queen shaking hands with Martin McGuinness. It was really unreal, and everybody was, you know, talking. Oh, that, that's just happened. I didn't realise I was actually the one who had done it, you know. So it was a bit of a pat in the back for me. It was a nice one to do.